After many years of using the free version of Avast, I've decided to upgrade the protection on my desktop computer. Let's go through the upgrade procedure. What I want to put on here is the Premier, which is the top of the line. want one year's protection and what I want to do in this case is protect this PC so it's one PC and this says here easy renewal service enabled which is automatic renewal at the end of the year at this point that is not what I want to do so I will uncheck the easy renewal service which means when the year is up I'll wind up with a reminder so what we now have is we have a vast premier on one PC for one year back in a second once I finish entering the rest of the information. I'll be using my PayPal. Payment has been processed and I'll be getting an email shortly with the license number and we'll continue from there. Our next step is to open the email and you'll see in here the download for the license file which we'll need download the license file to make it easier, I've downloaded the license file to my desktop so I can get to it easily once I need it. Next thing will be to install Avast Premiere. Simply click on the link. The file is 122 megabytes, so the amount of time needed to download it will depend on your internet speed. install Avast Premiere. In my case I've already bought the product so I'll check this box and I always use a custom installation. That way I get to see what's being installed and where it's being installed. Now it's asking me to insert my license I've saved it to the desktop, so we'll browse. There's a license file, so we'll select it. Select continue. For now, we'll go with everything that's checked. I can always come back later and make changes.
installation is now complete. Time to restart. And when we come back, we'll see what it looks like. Avast Premiere is now installed on this computer. Everything is good. Everything's up to date. Firewall is active and all shields are active. And my subscription is good for one year. Approximately two weeks prior to the end of the year, I'll get a reminder that it'd be time to renew and at that time I can make my decision whether I want to continue with Premiere or change to something else or go back to the free version. Stay safe, be free, I hope this helps.